Thanks for your interest in my 36 Ford pickup. I have lots of questions come in already, so I thought I'd go ahead and do a video and answer as many of them as I could. Uh, the brakes are 40 Ford hydraulic brakes that I rebuilt. And they're fresh. New hoses. Uh, 42 to 48 split wishbone. Vega cross steering. New aluminum radiator. Uh, the engine's a 305 out of a Chevy van. It's got 80,000 actual miles along with its 350 turbo automatic. Um, I left the clutch pedal in the chassis in case somebody wants to make it into a, a manual transmission again. Um, it's got a boat horn. I re recessed the firewall and used the original firewall so it still looked correct and rustic. Uh, chopped it two and a half inches. Uh, the windshield does crank out, the cowl vent does open, all those things are functional. Had a lot of people ask me about rust on it. Uh, I put new rockers in it, both sides. Uh, this cab corner had a little hole in it, uh, right on the bead, and I just put some glue over it. So that's really the only spot I didn't address. I put a full bottom on this door. There's a one corner spot on the other door. I'll show you when I get over there. I took about four inches out of the grill, replaced all the teeth, and took about three inches of length out of it right here to lean it back more like a 34 car. I've got dual exhaust and it all tucks in the frame rails in the cross members so none of it's close to the ground. Uh, oak floor in the bed, gas tank filler. Underneath here I've got a 39 Ford car gas tank along the back. Uh, my battery is right in this corner under here. I used an 80 five or so Monte Carlo rear end with a the rubber mounted triangulated four bar and then I used coil over shocks and this drum brakes back here as well I used the split wishbone as the lower four bar so it gives it the old look but it rides like a, a newer one here's a picture of the back cab corner. All the metal on the cabs have been repaired. The box, they shortened about 11 inches and the stake pockets were quite rusty. The rest of it is pretty well intact. The front panel's a little rough. Alright Dan, go ahead and take it around there and Show us it running. pretty cold out today it's been snowing and I just washed it again because I've got slush and water all over it I don't know what he's doing, if he's going to turn around or... Us. There he comes. Yeah. 
It's a very quiet ride. It's pretty tight. I've got 500 miles on it so far. I drive it every day. And uh, I've got most of the rattles and bugs worked out of it. Goes down the road real nice. I do have the set of wire wheels. They're 16 inch wire wheels. I've been driving it in this weather, so that's why I changed it to these radials. Uh, I've actually been driving it in the snow. But uh, the radials do ride better down the highway. I think I like the looks of the wire wheels better myself. Well, I don't know what else I can show you. It is what it is. It's been a lot of fun. I've got other projects to build and racing season coming up. I race dirt track and it's time to move on. So I hope you can bid on it and enjoy it as much as I have. Thank you.